first throw up of the pregnancy, right? This is where Zeus was protected from being eaten by his father. Let's Jeez. see if April can handle the smell. <laughs> I just got tickled by a lady in there. <laughs> All right, good morning. We are heading out, checking out of the hotel. We got a fun day of adventure. Um, April had some uh, kind of crappy up in this morning. this morning. First throw up of the pregnancy, right? I'd say second, because I threw up when I was had the flu, but it wasn't related to pregnancy, it was the flu. Yeah. But now, this is my first pregnancy bar. It was horrible. So that's exciting. But then I still felt sick even after I ate breakfast, so I took a Zofrin, magic. But you hadn't taken this pregnancy I still feel yet. a little nauseous, but I feel much, like, it was like, oh, relief. <laughs> yeah. So, so there is I'm some help. I'm getting a little tired, actually, now. <laughs> Good. We got a little bit of a drive. We're doing some sightseeing today. Cave of Zeus. Here's our tour bus. There's Miss Shumway. Hello! There's Kai Dada. Shumway. Davies. Yes, Mr. yes. Davies. yes. yes. Are you guys still having fun on our Greece tour? About ready to go home, I miss the kids. We're getting to that point in the trip where it's like, all right, it's time to go home, I miss my babies. This is cool, this is a very diverse, very mountainous region. Olive trees everywhere. So many olive trees. Olive trees in Utah, it's a very uncommon thing. Hold on, hold on. We've got a Ohana sighting. There he is, Jay Spanett creeping. April's smells are affecting her so much right now. I have to stay like 20 feet away from her. I have icy hot on my legs and if I smell, if there's any smell, even if it's a good smell, she's, it makes her vomit, so I have to just stay away from her. All right, here's our first look at the plateau. Sheep grazing down there. Can't really see right now, but there's a whole mountaintop full of snow up there. This is a really cool place. In the middle of Crete. This is all farmland. It used to be full of windmills that were used to pump the water out to the other parts of the land. Here's the, uh, yeah. Just ate a bug, I think. <laughs> um, we're going to the Cave of Zeus. It's quite the hike. Going up here. Not sure if everybody's gonna go or not, but it'll be a bit of a hike. So I clarified, I was curious if people actually believe the Greek mythology, but it's all pretty much well accepted that it was just stories to explain things that happened. But still, it's all part of their history, so it's still super important to, to everybody. Here we have April, she's uh, hanging in there. Are you gonna make the hike? You gonna go for it? Are you? Oh, I'm going there. It's... I just wish I could eat first and then do it. Can we just steal you an orange? There's an orange right there. Look, I'll get you one. Well, it's in a pot, but that's the building we're going to right there. Hey, we're getting some fresh orange juice. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Look at that. That's a nice juicer. Look at this thing, April. Oh, look at this. Yes, the smile. Yes. It's as, as fresh as it gets. April, my friend. This is very important. Up we go, up we go. Up the hill. Okay, there's the view from the top. I believe Jay sells me lunch and I owe him lunch. Well, actually, let me get in the door. This. Hello. Oh, ticket counter. Hello. Our tour guide is coming. They're coming. Hello, thank you. Yeah, we're going down, down, down. This is where Zeus was protected from being eaten by his father, who also eats rock babies. Look this. Stalactites and stalagmites. April, what are your thoughts after experiencing that was really cool. Zeus's childhood? I'm so out of breath. It was a bit of a hike. Oh. This ain't no willy-nilly stroll it's up and stroll down. Here. The people, it seems like most of them are like more atheist than anything. Like they don't believe. Like her, like I asked if I asked if people believe yes. in the, that the gods really existed, like, and she said it's no. just fairy tales. No. No. They they tell stories. Like that's to why explain, democracy was first born here. To explain the way things happened, yeah. 
like the stories of the gods that like even a god can't stay in power forever. <coughs> so that kind of stuff makes sense. But she said all religion is like that. So I think that's a general consensus here that it's yeah. all just stories. It's all it's like they've all that's their mentality kind of. And like every single tour guide has said like the people don't go to church religiously here. It's like maybe At like all. twice a year, once a year, three times a year at the most. Yeah, probably like it's 95% like, of the population. No one believes. It's, just, it's more just like culture. It's just culture. Yeah. yeah, it's interesting. Okay, we're gonna have to tough this out a little bit. We're all really hungry, but the we're gonna do pottery first. So if you see some grumpy faces during this, you'll you'll <laughs> you'll know why. Betsy, how are you holding up? I'm not awesome. You good? Okay. Oh, I don't know if April's gonna be able to come down here. Let's Jeez. see if April can handle the smell. Here we go. What's your prediction, Betsy? Can April handle this? No. Betsy's calling no. Kyle, what do you think? April's gonna handle this? No, she's gonna turn around. Okay, hard pass. Hard pass. <laughs> April, but Righteous Brothers, Unchained Melody. She's a brave soul. She won't last. <laughs> here we go. My cologne was unbearable, so this down here. Betsy, you are correct. 10 points for you. Kyle, 10 points for you. I'm gonna have to do this one without April, though. It's really sad. Guys, April's down here. I'm just gonna throw this out right now. You can do it. You got the right song for April. Let's see it. No, it's fun. Oh, yeah. April Jace. Get it. Yeah. Children be well. Okay, this is one of our last stops here. They've said they've tested this tree. This is a 2,000 year old tree. 2,000 years old. 2,000 years old. Right here. Yeah, that's amazing. Look at that thing. Holy cow. It's called a plane tree. Designated as a national monument, protected. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the past, many famous. Oh yeah, this thing is big. Look at that trunk. Here, all the way to there. Natural spring. Uh, I had an experience just now that was very unique. I don't think anyone else has had in Greece. I just got tickled, like a tickle attack, like a tickle fight. By, I just got tickled by a lady in there. She, I'll, I'll reenact it. What blue? Oh, nothing. <laughs> She came at you like and I that? just ran away. That's how long it was. <laughs> and I was like, yeah. uh, like an employee. Like an yes. employee. And then I, then I <laughs> ran away as fast as I could. What blue? Tickle, 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 tickle. No, she said nothing, nothing. It was so weird. Did you know, guys? Welcome back. That Betsy has a vlogging channel. The Mixell family. The Mike Sell. Is that how you pronounce it? But they deserve a huge shout out and lots of love because she just gave me a big hunk and I've been craving these ever since I saw her on the first day. She ate one and I was like, Tell me that. Is that a big hunk? Oh, you kept giving me pieces. She was sharing the whole time, but they gave me a whole one to myself. She also let us use a lot of other things like chargers for phones when they were dying. I'm just, you know, one of those people. I think she even Betsy did. has that pure love inside of her where she just I, gives. She just that. gives. <laughs> Tell me your side of the story of that, what just happened in there. When I got tickled and I ran away. <laughs> she sounds, she's acting like it's a really private story, but I... So, I just, I said, <laughs> I just told her, I, I don't know what I'm saying, because I don't know what I'm telling you, because she's embarrassed about it. I was like, your eyes are beautiful, you have brown and blue, do you have contacts? And she said, She's like, come here. She didn't want to tell me, and I was like, what? Just tell me, it's okay. And then she pulled me to the side, and she goes, my energy heater told me there's somebody more pure than me by me, and they will look blue to them. Oh. So she's like, you must be pure. Uh -uh. I could see a blue circle around her eyes, too, when I You're pure. It. Yeah. Instead of explaining the story to me, she decided just to tickle attack me. <laughs> totally logical. Maybe I was pure, too. Yeah. Didn't give me the benefit of that lady. Teaching all of our friends how to cowboy cha-cha. Yeah. So here we go. <laughs> Okay guys, um, we're making it. We got one more little plane. We're going back to Athens and going home in the morning. We ate lunch at like one or two. We finished at like two. We got to the airport four hours early and there's no good food here. It was like 
bread. April's having a really and hard time meat. right now. That was like all they had, and orange juice. And I drank an orange juice, and I've been eating chips and stuff, but like, I'm so nauseous. That's one problem with traveling mornings with morning sickness. You don't have control over the meals that you're able to get. Yeah. And then on top of that, I took a Zofran this morning, so I was super nauseous. I actually like got sick this morning, then took a Zofran, and that helped me with the nausea. Not the worst gas, TMI, I know, but like, it's like constipation is one of the side effects of Zofran. Davey's like, don't talk about that. Oh, it's real. This it's is real. the real deal, guys. But like, it's, I don't think it's a good trade off. I just don't even know. I don't like it. It hurts. Okay, guys, like, this trip like is basically over. This is the final thing. It the greasy 14, the counter. final count. I think we gotta bring it in for one final no, um, so. opa. Let's just give him an opa. Oh, one, two, three, opa! April, high and low. I was probably that castle because it was so beautiful. It was like photo, any direction, any place. So beautiful. So great. Acro so beautiful. was amazing. It's a beautiful day. Low oh, was I every mean, other moment puking. Puking. All of the and trying not to die. You did it though, we made it through it. I'm not home yet. Oh, we still have a five hour flight. We're essentially home. Michelle's got her back in all things. Yes, um, I do. Yeah, and uh, care for you, girl. Another high was when Ashley massaged my. She uh, completely my cleared up it, your shoulder. After that, I literally never it was, again. You couldn't even lift your I arm. So check out the Gardner Quad Squad. Squad, they're really good at massaging. But okay, guys, we're gonna go home, see the kids. They'll be asleep when we get there. But thanks for watching, and we will see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye. Good evening.